Maybe you've heard the line, singing is praying twice. The actual quote which comes from St. Augustine is, singing well is praying twice. But I would add, what we sing makes the difference. Hi, I'm Father James Kubicki, and I thought of that today because it's the feast of a man who was given the title, Harp of the Holy Spirit. Why? Well, he was a poet and a musician in the fourth century, and he got his start when he heard various heretical groups using good music and songs to spread their false teachings. The Harp of the Holy Spirit, or Saint Ephraim, decided to fight fire with fire and began creating beautiful hymns that presented good orthodox teaching. And this was the beginning of something we're all familiar with, singing hymns in church. Since it's the month of the Sacred Heart, I'd like to share with you today the lyrics of one of St. Ephraim's songs. It includes images of how Jesus' side was pierced when he hung on the cross, and how the prodigal son ran away from his father's house, and how the good Samaritan helped the man who had been beaten and robbed. Here's how it goes, though the translation is not as poetic as the original would have been. The soldier's lance pierced your side, and the sufferings which you underwent for my sake are continually telling me, see how I loved you? You have brought me to the house of my father, the house from which I had run away. You have prayed for me. You have given me wine to drink and have poured oil on my wounds. You have broken bread for me. And now, very joyfully, I live like a bride in the room your love prepared. <laughs> 